Hi there, I'm Laura Harms. I'm a certified Zentangle teacher and today I am working through Inktober Tangles and I am just about done here. We have just a few um, tangles left on the list. Today I'm working on Cubell and I'm using a Bijou tile and my dip pen and my Zebra G nib and today I am going to use this ink. This is Diamine fountain pen ink and the color is majestic blue it's pretty like a nice royal blue type color but it has a little bit of a red sheen if you lay it down really thick um, I really enjoy this blue so I this is another one of those tangles that I've never done before Cubell so let's try it together shall we so it's uh, based on a leaf pattern. So I'll just draw a little leaf. Maybe I'll get some ink on my pen first. There we go. Okay, then the next thing is to draw a curvy line down the middle and then cross that with a curvy line going this way. Okay, then Fill in this little one with a little curly. Cool. All right. So I will do a few more of these. They don't seem to take very long. market for like an everyday using ink this is a really good one like, say you work in an office and you can't get away with using like I don't know pink or green ink it's a nice ink and that little red sheen is kind of like a happy little secret just like Bob Ross been a really fun experiment doing these <clears throat> um, tiles with all my different fountain pen inks because they all react so differently in the nibs some of them have no problems in the nibs and then they and they seem to come out really smoothly other ones I'm you know I struggle with it's just interesting to see the properties of the ink, like I've never tested them with dip pens before. After today, there's just two more tiles to do. And I'm wondering if I'm gonna have enough different types of fountain pen ink to make it all the way to the end.
<laughs> it's funny how I just I keep wanting to push the pen like I would with a micron, but it really does not like that. It likes to be dragged. digging this tile. <laughs> oh man, I have so much ink on my hands. So that's Cubell. That's my inky finger. <laughs> And there you have it. So just two more tiles left before Inktober is done. So if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of the videos when I post them. And in the comments below, let me know what you'd like to see in November. Would you like to see tutorials or just me tangling? Let me know and um, we'll try and make this channel awesome together. Bye, see you next time.